guys, welcome to Dolly & Associates. I'm Dolly. Today we bring together two influential men of industry, masters of the marketplace and kings of the car lot in an epic battle to the finish line to raise awareness of a community resource that could play a significant role in your life. Roll the intro. from Cranbrook Dodge and Buck Drawback <laughs> from Spring Honda. Gentlemen, thank you for joining me today on Dolly & Associates. What are we up to today? Well, we're here to talk about uh, the foundry and uh, the car race we got going on So there. these gentlemen have let me talk them into competing in my own version of Mario Kart, and we're doing it for a good cause. I think, and I think you can agree, that sometimes growing up, being a youth, it feels like a large body shoved into a tiny vehicle, going around a track with bumps and bananas thrown at you, and you don't really know what's happening. Correct? Uh, I, I, yeah, yeah, I'd say so. It's going to feel like that today, that's for sure. So, uh, so the conversation, you guys play a lot of, you do a lot of community pieces. Yeah, we do lots of charities. So does Spring Honda. Yeah. They're amazing. And uh, I think the whole idea here is that everybody comes together and helps out the community in so many different ways. Uh, Spring Honda, they, I know they sponsor hockey teams and uh, there's also all, all other sorts of events that are going on in this community that Spring Honda gets involved in. And, Cranbert Dodge also, we've always been back in the hockey teams when we can, and any other events. I've gotten involved in many, I've had my head beat up and I've been thrown off a bowl, but it's all been for, for a good cause. So. Excellent. Um, so the wonderful thing about community and connection is that we, those mentors in the community, the champions, the leaders step forward and they really make a difference and you guys are, are a strong part of that. So today I am using your influence. Um, to talk about a wonderful cause that is up and coming in the community, the East Kootenai Foundry. Right. Yes. So can you tell me what the Foundry is? Yeah, the Foundry is uh, it's basically a safe place for, for youth aged 12 to 24 to go to if they're struggling with uh, mental issues or uh, substance issues. Yeah. Um, and it's come about, whereas before you used to have to go see a doctor and then you had to wait to go and see somebody to get help. The foundry is different. If somebody's in trouble or needs help, they can walk through the doors and they can get help right now. There's no red tape, there's nothing. They walk in, the people are there to help these youth get the help they deserve right now. And it's hard for the youth these days. Mm -hmm. It's been, especially the last couple of years, it's been really tough. Their lives have been turned upside down and uh, the foundry's there to help them. It's a great cause. We have had uh, a lot of our atmosphere shift and a lot of that pressure is put onto the youth. Um, so to create a resource that's directly for them and that's more hands-on, a, a beautiful piece of our community that's up and coming. It's sometimes growing up in relation to the foundry and being a youth and having those troubled times, sometimes it feels like shoving yourself in a little car over some bumps doing a racetrack. So that's what we're gonna do today. That's what we're gonna do. I'm very excited. <laughs> Hey, Buck, you got yourself a helmet? I didn't bring one, no. Hey, man, I got you covered, don't worry. Thanks, Steve. It fits. Ready. What do you got under the hood there, Buck? Yeah, doing some last minute tune ups here, Steve. Oh, nothing nothing, nothing to see. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Bumping, racing. Watch the camera. Banana! <laughs> Banana! Banana! <laughs> you can do a push and hold them back. Swerve the banana. 
<laughs> oh, no. I'm out of juice! Yes. <laughs> I'm out of juice! Steve! Make it! Come on, Steve! For the foundry! Woo! The winner is Steve Mercandelli from Cranbrook Dodge. Buck and Steve, thank you so much for your time. That was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. Okay. I hope the bananas didn't hurt or injure anyone. I was nervous. I was scared. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> We're gonna spin out at five miles an hour. It's true, but you did great. So this was meant to encourage folks to check out the foundry. And what's great also is that these vehicles were purchased by the dealerships, but they're gonna be auctioned off by the dealerships and that money is gonna to go to the foundry again. So we're really just creating conversation and culture within the community. And I wanna thank you guys for coming out, for allowing me to throw bananas at you. I've been waiting a long time for that. Um, I'm gonna let you guys go and we're gonna head over to the actual foundry site and have a chat with some representatives to get a bit more information. So thank you again. Thank you for having